guys, how's it going? So I decided halfway through the day yesterday to just not record the vlog. And that's just because the weather was just so terrible, so I couldn't go out and do anything before I actually was with Bianca for, well, let's face it, most of the day. But I do want to talk to you guys about what we did. So we went to this really nice French restaurant in the city. I think it was called La Papillon. I can't remember. Don't quote me on that. I'm not too sure what it was called. Ever since I got back from Europe, I have been craving snails. That just sounds weird to say out loud, but I just loved eating snails. There's something about it. I mean, I guess you could kind of compare it to eating oysters, even though I hate eating oysters. I don't understand why I hate oysters, but I love snails. I've just been obsessed with like French culture for most of my life, I think. Just why I decided to try and learn the French language in my first year of university. I actually got a distinction in my first semester. And in the second semester, I guess the sort of novelty wore off and I got through with a pass. To be honest, I think the teacher just felt bad for me because I wanted to learn so much. But to learn a language as quick as they want you to at university, you have to be studying pretty much every single day. And I could do that my first semester, no problem. But then second semester, I guess things just caught up with me. I got a job, I had more intense subjects to do. And I guess the novelty of being a university student had already worn off by then. Oh my god. Guys, there's an intense magpie fight going on outside. Whoa. You won, buddy. What have I been doing today then? It's already pretty late in the afternoon, as usual, and I've been up to the shops and I had to buy a new hard drive. Four terabyte hard drive. Cost me about just under 300 bucks. And I got it from the Apple store, and to be honest, I was actually surprised of the price of this. I mean, a lot of four terabyte hard drives are around 250 to 400 bucks anywhere else. And you would expect Apple of all places to be, I guess, more expensive. And the reason I went to Apple rather than to somewhere like JB where they might have had a bit of a cheaper one was because this is USB-C and since I have my new 2016 MacBook Pro, which is USB-C only, I wanted to make sure I got a USB-C cable. Not just because this is only USB-C, but because the transfer speeds on USB-C are amazing. And I know I'm still promising a review on this new MacBook Pro, which I think I might actually do in the next few days because the guys at the store were actually asking me how it was because I brought up that I was buying it because of this new MacBook Pro. I've had it for like two or three months now, I think. And, you know, I've had a few bad things, had some great things. So I feel like I'm in a position to talk about how good or bad it is. Also, also my um, Gorillapod actually kind of broke. So that whole thing, I was just kind of resting you up here. <laughs> old external hard drive, I first have to plug in my dongle, which goes into the side of the computer like this, and then I have to plug it in. Alright guys, so I just got back from my second session of soccer, and once again, it kind of just made a big point to highlight how much I really need to improve on my stamina, because that's like the one main thing that's lacking, I feel, in my football, I feel like I'd be so much better if I just had so much more energy and stamina. Also, I'm starting to get some blisters on my foot which I blisters are just the worst thing about the soccer season so now I'm just gonna have a quick shower have some dinner and then I'm gonna keep playing around with this new hard drive I got I'm gonna try and find out the best way to store everything I guess 